All right, guys, we've had a bit of a debacle this morning. Dan was gonna fish with me, had some car problems. He ended up having to go home. Um, I'm gonna try something different. I'm in the little kayak. Hadn't did this in a long time, so some big bluegill for bait. Took me a second to get everything straight. We're gonna try to troll some ledges. We don't have much wind today. It's after the new moon. Just trolling backwards, guys. Got a planer board on the right side a straight line on that side and we're just going to go backwards down this ledge just working the ledge all the way down something i've always wanted to try blue cat fishing has been pretty tough for me this season every time i try to go wind doesn't line up moon doesn't line up weather doesn't line up i can't get bait one or the other something's always going on but got some bait on this day decided to go out there and give some trolling a try with planer boards and one straight line. You can see right there at planer board flying past, uh, they really take it. It's almost like fishing with a big bobber when you're pulling these boards and you get a big fish that takes it down hard like that. Very simple to do out of a kayak. When you just uh, put one, one or two planer boards out, you're able to troll really well with no wind. And that's uh, what we're doing here. This catfish is hooked really well with that catfish sumo 10 odd hook that I linked in the last description of the last video. That's a, a Parks planer board. They work really well. The uh, dragging weight I have there, I believe, is a Carolina Lake weight. I'm not sure on that. Uh, you don't want to use as big a weight as you do when you're just dragging a straight line with a planer board. It kind of weights it down, but that's a great fish right there. And on this next video here, you'll see the planer board just take off man it's really cool to watch these these fish when they they hook up and uh just jerk the planer board you'll see it flying across the water right there planer boards are just another thing to add to your arsenal as a kayak fisherman i think that it can help you on days when there's not wind you need to have options out there stuff that you can go to when nothing else is working out and these planer boards will help you with trolling so you can get a line spread on your line. They make right or left planer boards and you can run more than one out of a kayak at once, at least two, without a problem. All that being said, I believe that planer boards are a great way to combat the wind in a kayak or the lack of wind in a kayak when you can just get out there and not have any wind and still be able to fish. It's a viable tool. Uh, maybe when I get a trolling motor in the future with Spotlock and um, course navigation GPS, it'll really help with uh, trolling in the future. I will advise you of this. A lot of times when you're fishing planer boards out of a kayak, these foot fish sometimes, even though they really, really take it down hard, you have to get a hook set pretty quick or they, or they will get off. Uh, out of a boat, it doesn't seem to be as bad as a kayak because you have a stable platform with some weight to it. With a kayak, you have given the kayak, you have given the rod, given the line, and a lot of times these fish will take it down hard, and it's kind of a heartbreaker when you uh, seem to miss quite a few of them. But that's just part of it. Just another way to get out there and be able to fish when there's no wind. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Killer be out.